Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to those of you who are new. My name is Brianna Weiler and today I'm going to be showing you my Costco haul. It is a big one yet again. Um, this is our monthly haul so this one's going to last us a little bit longer. We got produce and pantry stuff but I'm going to get you turned around and show you what we do have on the table here and what we were able to get at our Costco this time. So I will also have the prices. I always try to put the prices on the bottom of the screen so that way you know kind of what prices are in other places if you're interested in that kind of thing. So I really hope you guys enjoy this and let me turn you around. All right, so I'm gonna start over here. I grabbed this dragon fruit bite-sized cubes bag. It's three pounds. Remember the price will be down here on the screen. This just sounded really good to add to smoothies. I have some fruit in my freezer that I need to get used up, some frozen fruit, but I figured adding this into smoothies would be really good. Um, getting dragon fruit here is not super easy because we live up in North Dakota and it's also winter time so yeah anyways we just don't get it as easily and I know I like it so I grabbed some and I figured that'd be great to add to smoothies um, my husband got some crab cake minis they have a little asterisk next to the price in the store so I figured it would probably be a good time for him to get them I don't eat seafood so these will be something he has for like a lunch or dinner when we just kind of are finding our own things so so we grabbed those for him to have and then my husband also grabbed some organic hummus and they're in the little cups so there's 20 of them that'll last for some time the date on the box is I'll pop on the top it's good till April so we have some time to get those eaten up and then back here we got single uh, serve pizzas, six pepperoni, six cheese, and we figured we'd try these out this time. We usually get big frozen pizzas, but I figured these would be good for lunches and dinners. They'd be good to have on hand, so I grabbed those. Then we grabbed some more of the Siete grain-free tortilla chips. These are our, some of our favorite tortilla chips. My husband loves them just as much as I do, and we weren't a huge fan of the tortillas that we tried. It just may have been the way I cooked them. Not sure, so we just aren't a fan of those but these tortilla chips are really good so we got some more of those and we get two bags each time because we eat through them fairly quickly we grabbed more of the Yoplait yogurt because Costco doesn't always carry it so we grabbed some and that's good until the middle of March and it is February 25th so we'll have some time I was buying to hopefully last us through a good portion of March because I'm working quite a bit so it won't be as easy for us to get to the store obviously we can still go because the store is open when I'm off of work but just won't be full of energy to go and do it as much. So we grabbed some more yogurt. My husband grabbed some more of his sweet mini peppers. So we have those. He likes those for salads and sandwiches and use them for a bunch of different things. I say that in probably every one of my videos that has those. Um, then we grabbed some chicken breast. I have some recipes or some marinade recipes that I want to share with you guys in a new dinner video. So I grabbed chicken breast because they called for chicken breast in the recipes. So I figured I would do the recipes with these. And I also have some tenderloins in the fridge that or freezer that I will probably use up. But I just figured I would get this. And it was $2.99 a pound for the chicken breast and just over eight pounds. And they will probably be frozen. So I don't have to worry about the March 9th date too much much and we grabbed some more of these Amy Lou teriyaki pineapple with chicken meatballs. They are delicious. I forgot to check for the teriyaki sauce that we got there because um, we've been eating those with the Kinder's teriyaki sauce and I just used it up last night and finished up one of the pack. We really like these meatballs. They are pretty good. They're easy. I throw them in the oven. They cook up. I cook some white rice and then we throw some teriyaki sauce with it and then just have some kind of vegetable with it and it's a pretty fast and easy dinner. So we grabbed those and then these just bare lightly breaded chicken breast chunks are really good. They are my fa some of my favorite frozen like popcorn chicken type thing. They do taste similar to Chick-fil-A and I've heard that they taste just like Chick-fil-A. In my opinion they're similar to it not the exact same but pretty dang close. So we got those and we figured we'd have that with some mac and cheese or some noodles or something we have in the pantry. So there is that. Our Costco had the Mrs. Myers three pack again. This one has the rose scent the lemon for verbena I guess is how you'd say that and then there's the mint flavored one or flavored you don't eat these <laughs> scented one so rose rose scented lemon verbena and mint scented not flavored 
I don't know why I said that. Um, we got two bunches of bananas. We were able to get them fairly green, so hopefully they last us some time. They were three pound bunches. We just got the regular bananas. The organic looked not so great this time, so we grabbed these ones because they actually looked better than the organic. And then my husband also grabbed some more lettuce. I will be cutting this up and prepping it for him to have in the fridge. But yeah, it's five lettuce heads and they're the romaine lettuce so he has that then he also grabbed some of these my husband grabbed some of these easy peel oranges it's a five pound bag they're like the little cutie or halo oranges they're easy to peel and good to have on hand for a quick and easy breakfast lunch snack then we grabbed a 12 pack of green beans we were running low on our vegetables or canned vegetables so i grabbed some of those and my husband grabbed some lagunitas uh, it's a tri pack so it has three different the three different types in the pack and they were I think this one had an asterisk on it, so they're getting ready to get rid of it again for a little while at least. So he grabbed that to have in the pantry as backup for whenever he gets low again. And then I grabbed some more, uh, not green beans, black beans, because our black beans, I think I have like two cans left in the pantry. When I cleaned out my pantry, that's when I realized I needed some more, so I grabbed another pack of those. Then Ritz crackers, we only have like two or three sleeves of those, so we grabbed another pack of them, and it's 18 stacks. I think we have like two or three stacks left, so there's that. And then we got the Guerrero tortillas. It's a twin pack, so two 15 count tortillas, so 30 total, I believe would be what it is and i'm these are some of my favorite tortillas they feel super fresh i can't wait to eat them they'll make great quesadillas and yeah then i grabbed or my husband grabbed some of these clorox disinfectant wipes to go pack which will be good for him to have for the gym we can also take them with us on the airplane to disinfect if we ever whenever we go on our next trips have some in the cars for when we take road trips or whatever gas pumps or whatever too good to have just just good to have in the car so or just in general good to have so we have those and then we also grabbed some green grapes these look really good i can't wait to try them it's three pounds and the produce is actually starting to look better so yeah i can't wait to try those they look delicious and then there are strawberries they look pretty red and it is a how many 32 ounces of strawberries so i'm gonna clean those up cut them up and that'll be our produce for the next week ish probably two week with the strawberries grapes oranges and bananas so that i believe is all we also grabbed some of the kirkland bath tissue over here but that's pretty self-explanatory so we got the kirkland bath tissue and i think that is all i think that's all of our stuff i think i went over everything i don't think i missed anything this time oh we also have milk in the refrigerator and eggs so we did get milk and we got eggs and those are still in the fridge because when we got home i put everything in the fridge and freezer ate my lunch and then took everything back out and put it on the table so we did get milk and eggs as well this grocery trip but otherwise this is everything here and yeah so i hope you guys have a great one if you guys like this one please give it a big thumbs up if you have any comments don't leave them down below i'd love to have a conversation with you down in the comments and please hit that red subscribe button and join my youtube family i'd love to have you guys here and until next time bye